<laughs> Normally, the Cookie Monster is someone that you would love to see. Cookie! Makes you laugh, a lot of fun. Not in Santa Cruz, California. Mm. Police are warning you, if you see this guy... Hello! Dressed as Cookie Monster... It is me. Don't engage with him. I guess he's been aggressive. Mm. And he's been badgering people. Uh. He's See, causing it's trouble. <laughs> it's not it's good, good enough, enough for him. For me. Apparently, it's not. Uh, here's the story from uh, <laughs> KSBW TV. Take a listen. It's the creepy monster, not the cookie monster. Creeped out and uncomfortable is what visitors on the Santa Cruz Wharf are feeling after encountering this man dressed in a cookie monster costume. The man is believed to badger people and aggressively yell. We saw him at the beginning of the wharf and. Um, at first glance, it seemed like maybe it would be fun to do a selfie or something with him, but we mm. were a- away from him. And then we went to the back of the wharf by the sea lions, and that's when we noticed him coming out um, that direction, making a commotion, and he was getting in getting in um, people's faces. I saw him on the day that the Sesame Street creator died, and uh, I told you he's, he's sad about that. <laughs> He hasn't been the same since. How you doing? <laughs> How you turned into a life of drinking and the drugs because the creator of the Sesame Street. Is that Street Jim Henson? No, is it is that, that's not no, Jim Henson. Right? No, it was Who not. Was it was another Sesame guy. Street. Sesame Street creator. Now he's the cocaine monster. Yes. <laughs> I swear to God, I saw the same guy Jim in Henson. Vegas. Jim Henson. Yeah. yeah. That's what I said. Didn't that's, oh, yeah, that's what you that said. said. Okay. So confused. He's like, he's the guy too. that made the puppets. But I, don't I thought know. he was yeah. the puppeteer. I didn't know he. I didn't know he created that yeah. whole show. Yeah, okay. I thought oh, he just did the puppets for him. He was one of the co-creators of Sesame okay. Street. So when he died, it was yeah, it was bad times spiral. for this guy. Because I've seen the he's Vegas. Been angry ever since, I believe there's a Vegas Cookie Monster that's out there. Oh, there's multiple. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, that smells really bad. It's a very very bad smell. Very expected. Not in Santa Cruz. No. But then he kept showing up, and I guess people are complaining out here about him. The Santa Cruz Police Department is warning visitors to keep an eye out for the man, telling them to not engage. Police tell us the man has faced criminal charges in other parts of the country, although police could not provide any additional details. Yeah, he's a weirdo for sure. He puts a W in weirdo. I actually got him to take a picture of my dog. Yeah, he kind of creeped my dog out too. The police say they've received several calls, but at this point, the man has not committed any crimes in the city. So he's just allowed to continue being Cookie Monster? Yeah, until someone kicks him out of there. (laughs) Also, his real name is Adam Sandler. Yeah, in real life? (laughs) In real life, that's his name. No No relation, but his name... According to the the news report that I read, his real name's Adam Sandler. What My happened? name is Adam. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Sandler. Really? Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> That's different. Adam Sandler. Has that led to your life of troubles? It is Being just Latino a name Adam I am Sandler? giving. It is just a name I am telling ah. the police. Yeah. May not be your real name. You got it, Dave. So for you, C is cocaine, or is C he? is for cocaine. <laughs> it's good enough for that me. is good enough for me. <laughs> C is for cocaine. <laughs> That's good enough for me. Do you make those noises? C too? is for cocaine. <laughs> That's good enough for me. One, two, three. Snack time. <laughs> Line time. <laughs> <laughs> Light him up, light him up, light him up, light him up. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I don't like those imposter characters. No, no. I don't. Vegas, no. No Times Square. Okay, but think about it, right? So we had two people complaining about the guy, both of which tried to get pictures of him. So it's it's your fault as well. Yeah, you're right. People yeah, that are complaining, it. like it's your fault because he's realized, oh wow. um... I can, people here want to take pictures of me, of me or with me. And you know, part of the altercations are probably like he's asking for money, right? Like, hey, yeah, yeah. You, I, oh, you, t- you, you got the picture, yeah. but that's going to be 10 bucks or whatever. And then people are like, no. Because that's what they do. They're like, yeah, yeah, get a picture, picture. Uh-huh. And then they're like, yeah, okay, $10. Yeah. Exactly. After the picture. Yeah. And, and he's probably a little aggressive. And Trying to get your money? Yeah. There was a guy dressed as Michael Myers. In Vegas, that was like following me around for a while. I Just not, being creepy. I did not like it. Yeah, no, no. I did not like it. Found no. a happy. Yeah, no. I was like, get wait. 
Do you want a picture with me? <laughs> no. I just met the Mexican minion. Oh, yeah. And it was the tiniest little, I mean, those costumes were small, right? It was uh -huh. the tiniest little person. They mm -hmm. broke character to get some air. And I was, <laughs> the smell, though, that came off. The smell. There's a lot of yeah. smells. Yeah. You can't I mean, just be walking Vegas around. Vegas heat inside one of those costumes for hours on end. Yeah. Whew. No good. So watch out for, if you're going to Santa Cruz, watch out for Cookie Monster. He's not He's out what there. he appears to be. He puts the W in his I just weird. like that their warning is to ignore him. Ignore him. Yeah. yeah. Just, just ignore Cookie Monster. Because if you pay attention to him and take a picture, Cocaine he, Monster comes yeah, after he, you, right? He wins. <laughs> yeah, he wins.